Customers love the fact that they get a discount for purchase. When customers are able to apply a coupon code for a discount during checkout, there is a feel-good factor about getting the best price. Here, we give you detailed steps on how to add coupons to your WooCommerce store. But before we get on with the explanation, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and click the notification icon so that you don't miss out on great content on WordPress and WooCommerce. Here on your WooCommerce dashboard, on the left hand side corner, you can see, coupons under the WooCommerce. If you do not see it, then go to WooCommerce settings, then in the general settings you see, enable coupons. In here, you can enable two options. One is to enable the use of coupon codes on your checkout page. The next way is calculating the coupon discounts sequentially. Here on enabling this, if you are applying multiple coupons, then the first coupon will be applied to the whole price, then the next one on the discounted price and so on. Now once the coupons are enabled, it is time to set up the coupons. On your WooCommerce, coupon settings, add your first coupon. You can either enter the coupon code manually or even generate the coupon code. The coupon code generated automatically is alphanumeric code which is used on the checkout screen. You can also provide a description if required for your future reference. Now you need to fill the coupon, general settings. Here you can see, three types of discount types which include, percentage discount, with this, you will be able to specify a percentage value that will be applied to the cart value. For example, you can choose this option and set 10 in the next field to provide a 10% discount on the cart value. When a customer tries to check out after applying this coupon code, a discount of 10% will be applied to the total cart value. Fixed basket discount, on the other hand, will apply a discount of the specified value to the cart. This will not depend on the products in the cart nor the total value of the cart. When a customer adds a product to the cart, the fixed discount will be applied. And the fixed product discount, the specified amount will be applied to each product in the cart. So here on applying a fixed product discount of 10, you can see the discount will be applied to all products in the cart. So, if there are 3 products in the cart then the discount amount will be $30. Now let us see how to customize the coupons. Every business is different hence, you want to customize the coupons as per your business needs. In the general section, if you recollect there is an option to set the expiry date for the coupon. Also, you can set if the coupons can be applied for free shipping. Here if you enable the free shipping with a coupon, you also need to ensure that you set free shipping on your store and then select free shipping with valid coupon in the shipping settings. Now let us see, what are the usage restrictions that can be applied to the coupons. In here you can see that you can set the minimum and maximum spend, to avail the discount. It helps to improve the average order value. Next comes the individual use only, when this is set, then the coupon also, this section you can specify the emails of customers who are allowed to avail that particular coupon code. This will help you offer personalized discounts to certain customers that cannot be used with other coupons in the store. The next coupon setting is the exclude sale items. Upon enabling is this, customers won't be able to apply it on products on sale. For basket coupons, it will apply only if no sale products are available in the cart. Also, you can include or exclude specific products in the scope of a coupon. While creating a coupon, specify the products you want to be included or excluded in the designated fields. Similarly, you can specify categories as well. Next is the usage limit settings. We have here three usage limits. Usage limit per coupon, here you can define how many times a coupon can be used before it expires. This allows you to limit the usage of the coupon. Simply enter a number to create the usage restriction. Limit usage to X items, this is applicable when you create product specific coupons. When multiple products with a coupon are applied, 
you can restrict the coupon to be applicable to only a specified number of products. For example, if you set this as 2, the discount will be applied only to 2 products in the cart even when more than 2 applicable products are available in the cart. Enter a value to define the usage limit. Usage limit per user, this one determines how many times a particular user can avail a coupon. An individual registered user will be recognized by the user ID, whereas a guest user is identified with the billing email ID. You can enter a number to specify the usage limit per user. Now once the coupons are set up, how do you let your customers know that you are offering such coupons on your store? You can copy the coupon code and send it via emails or even post on the website using attractive banners or even social media banners. No worries if you are not an expert in doing them. WooCommerce also has extensions, that just makes this quite easy. Let us take a look at those plugins. Smart coupons help you bulk generate coupons and send them to a lot of customers easily. You can also generate gift coupons and store credits using this plugin. URL coupons this plugin lets you associate a product as a free gift option. When the customer adds the coupon code, the free product will be automatically added to the cart. Group coupons. Based on user roles and customer groups, you can restrict who will be able to use the code with the help of this plugin. It will be a great help to create a custom coupon strategy on your WooCommerce store. WooCommerce coupon campaigns. It is important to measure the success of any marketing activity. This plugin will help you create coupon campaigns and measure their success rate easily. Coupon Referral Program This will help you create referral coupons on your WooCommerce store. Both parties, the customer who is referring and the customer who is referred, will be rewarded with this strategy. WooCommerce Coupon Restrictions In the default WooCommerce Coupon Settings, you can restrict customers only based on email ID when creating coupons. With this plugin, you can restrict coupon usage based on user roles, location, etc., as well as based on whether they are new or existing customers. Scratch coupons for WooCommerce. You can use this plugin to reduce cart abandonment on your store. It will help you send last minute offers to customers just when they show intent to leave the cart. The plugin will help you create interactive pop-up notifications on your store. Hence in this way, you can add, manage, and even strategize the coupons on your WooCommerce store. Thank you for watching. Check out LearnWoo.com for more articles, videos, and resources related to WordPress and WooCommerce. Go subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to follow us on our social media channels. If you have any ideas, suggestions, and topics to cover related to WordPress and WooCommerce, do let us know in the comments section.